Hey y'all, this is the, this is Mag1381 here, and this is the 963D track loader. Um, I, this is from 3000 Toys. Um, bought it not too long ago. I did a model unboxing for it, and I promised you a model review. Um, I would say, I mean, this, this is a very nice model. Um, hydraulics are very, very smooth on it. Um, you know, I can, I can put a, well, not too much weight on it, but, I mean, it'll hold up a bucket of dirt if you just put some dirt in there and hold it up. Um, real smooth and stuff. What I like about it is the tracks. The tracks are real, real small, but, and, you know, um, another thing I thought Norris Scott would have done better with would be the way they roll. These things, they roll like crap. Um, on carpet, they won't roll at all. Um, but, um, you know, they get stuck. They, they do sometimes, and then they get stuck. Um, you know, it's nothing really. Um, here's the underneath, you know, just pretty much. Um, you got your hydraulics in there and stuff for the bucket to raise it up and down. Um, we'll look at the cab now. The cab is definitely, uh, you, I don't know if you can see that, there's too much of a glare. Um, but it's joystick controlled, you know. Um, on the back here is the air conditioning unit. Supposedly, that's what I think it is. Um, here's the exhaust. Um, back here is the ripper. Um, pretty cool ripper. It stay up, you know. It has the hydraulics right there on the side. So that'll keep it up, raise it, lower it, raise it. Um, yeah, I just, I thought that North Scott would have done better. Um, yeah, I, I wish if they, they can make a, uh, the tracks better. That'd, that'd be pretty cool. So, um, I don't know what else. There's really about it. Um, there's, you know, some parts of it are plastic, like this back here. Um, the radiator and the, the cover back there is plastic. The, uh, roof, I think, is plastic. Or, that, yeah, that's metal, actually. Um, the air conditioning unit is plastic. The hydraulic cylinders are plastic. Um, like, different covers and guards and stuff are or plastic um but for the money uh, I would get it um if you're looking for something to put on a shelf I'm actually looking into producing stop motion so see what I'm gonna do that so um yeah it's definitely worth it at 3000toys.com thanks for watching